Hi guys, it's Sonia. Hope you're all doing good. Today is Saturday. Okay, I have a few stuff to share here and there and everywhere. Um, okay. First, I had forgotten to share this with you guys. Isn't this cute? And OMG, it better not be missing. Oh, God, I lost it. Okay. This is, uh, this came in, I think it was last month. And I'm in the Die Hard Club, uh, where it's Stephanie Bernard. Happiness is hot chocolate, hot cocoa is like a hug from the inside, warm wishes. Hot chocolate is the answer, who cares what the question is. Hello. <laughs> Isn't that so cute? And look at the little marshmallows. Now here she included the marshmallow dice. You guys can see there's two different sizes there. So that is awesome. And then you get the little card where it shares what it looks like. Isn't that so cute? Okay, and here are some other ideas for you to put your card together. Love it. So here is the die for it. Look at that spoon. And a few weeks ago, I, as a matter of fact, the same day I got it, which again was last month, I wanted to come in here and play with it, but I got caught up, as always, because, yeah. Anyway, guys, so that is, again, that, that was from last month. I got in, um, I don't even know if I have it in my room, but I am so glad that I got it. Uh, anyway. Let me show you the paper that came with it because, again, I have the board in my uh, in my bedroom. Uh, the, Tiffany, uh, totally Tiffany. There it goes. And it's one of those boards that you can spin your work around, which is awesome. I love it. I tried it already, and I love it. Uh, you can just have like me. I'm when I when I'm coloring, I'm turning my paper or turning my head. Um, I I'm hoping that I adapt to using this where I can just spin it and keep it moving and it's really nice it comes with this little clamp here to hold your project in place so that's really awesome so there and it comes in three different sizes that's what it says here and it's called a rotating design board comes in three sizes scrapbook is rotating design board that's what it's called and with that I got this included with it now I thought this was for um, storing the item itself but it's not this is actually to store your markers and yeah and it's how to fold your jumbo color keepers in a stand so that's pretty awesome and you guys missed the show that's what it looks like that's the same one I went with the color purple um, I keep my markers in its original packing um, and then also in the tin cans like Oh, yeah, yeah. I still have, every time I turn around, I think or thought I put all my Halloween stuff away and something else pops up. Yeah, so I got to get with the program, guys. This is where, you guys see this? It's all jacked up. Yeah, all dented. That's how I bought it anyway. And I don't want to take the logo off. I could do away with the price here, but I'll take care of that later. Not now. And this is not actually Marcus. These are my... Um, distress oxide distress paints for my uh, ink pads so I keep those in here they fit in and again it has that little window who says you can just use this for? look at that they're all there so that's what I use that some of those for and I might go with storing all my spectrum noir um, in here I haven't decided yet so uh, okay, so that was that with that said. I really don't need to keep these, but I just wanted to share with you guys what that looks like. And today I finally got my, where is it? Okay. Oh, guys, this, is, let me just share this with, I found this in the Dollar Zone store. There was only one. And this was only a dollar. And it's Sweet Home Collection. What is it? Gotta get a gun. Gotta get a gun? Mm, I don't think so. 
Tiny Blessing Angels, that's what it's called. But they're so stinking adorable. There was only, this one, I saw this one as I was checking out, so I grabbed it. It's so cute. Look at that, guys. And it's on a heart stand. You see that? Awesome. So I got that one. And I wanted to get a few so I can share with some of my crafty friends, but I only saw that one. So I'll probably go back because I was kind of in a hurry. I'll probably go back and check tomorrow. And then I got some of this. I know it says snow, but I don't want it for snow. I thought it'd be perfect to use for gnomes for their beer. So I got that. And I actually got two package. And, um, yeah. Oh, here it goes. Finally got my Crafters Companion gun. Did I need it? No, but I wanted it. Um, and you know how it folds over like that? How easy is that for storage, right? And, of course, it goes with my Gemini, so it was a must-have. And then with that, including, you get clear white and glitter... Emboss embossing powders that comes with that and you also get a glue pad kit that's awesome very sweet and it gives you one refillable um, glue whatever you call that a little glue bottle there it goes so that's what I got from HSN and I order it using a 20% off so, and this is what I found in that store, and I was like, OMG, this is gorgeous. So, I am not using it for my Christmas tree. I am going to do something else with it. So, I bought, let's see how I took the whole thing off, because I'm not used, I don't need that little piece that was there. So, I just got to make sure I shave it off nicely. Which it looks like it came out good. I might remove it, but I don't think so. So, just snipped it. Tim Holtz. You can do anything with these scissors, guys, but look how pretty this is. Let me just share, because this is... Look at all that bling -a bling bling Look at that. How pretty is that, right? And then it's got the faux fur here on top. So, I got that. I didn't even go into the crafting aisle today. There's so many people in that store. We went out shopping so that I can get... Thanksgiving dinner ready. So I'm also making the famous pasteles. Pretty sure most of you guys here know what that is, but it's like a meat pie. It's made out of plantain, bananas, potatoes, and some other um, other goodies. And then you can use pork or chicken. I use chicken. I, I wish my opera singer would shut up. That's my daughter. Okay, so then um, I went crazy looking for these at the Dollar Tree because um, Marshall's has it for $2. And I said, I'm going to cut these suckers up. I don't want to pay that much for them. So when I went to the Dollar Zone, they sure enough had them, and I was super ecstatic. that I. But after that, before that, I had picked up a few at um, the Dollar Store. So I got this one because it coordinates with this one, and it also coordinates with this color. So let's see how that's going to play out. And then I got this cute hurricane glass tube. And that I want for these guys. So I will share with you guys once its project is completed. And you could see the as to why they sell these things so cheap. They didn't come out as they were supposed to. But isn't that so pretty, that little tube? You can fill it up. I don't know if I have the little tiny bolitas that go in there, but I'll figure it out. So that was what I picked up, guys, from the Dollar Zone. And I'm having my son set my camera up downstairs. So there goes my son. I hope he can. So I can go downstairs and record from downstairs because I'm going to need a lot of room. And right now I don't have it in here. My table has my stamps that I pulled out and embossing folders because I started getting ready to make Christmas cards. And... and Thanksgiving cards also. And then on top of that, I I wanted to share with you guys. Did I stick it in here? I don't know. I cut out some penguins. I don't know where they went. They like really went north. I don't know. They went north to the North Pole, that is. I don't know where they went. So I can't find my little penguinos. They're in here somewhere, guys. Because like I said, I was moving stuff around. And everything is coming down on me. Ay, ay, ay. 
And today has been raining. It's snippy out and I'm not a happy camper. So, yes, but I got to go downstairs. Harvey's going to help me prep my turkey. And I like to soak it in lemon I, lemon juice water, if that, is that what you call it? And salt. So I'll leave it soak. That's for the turkey. Only because I don't like that if I... I've... I one time... I don't know whose house was it. that It was one of my family members. But, you know, I'm not going to put them out there like that. You don't need to know the name. <laughs> so when I went to eat the turkey that they served me, I swear it tastes like if I was just biting into... Um, it smelled like um, like wet chicken feathers, and I, I got nauseous. I couldn't eat it. So, you know, with that in my mind, in my conscience, so I need to make sure that my turkey is very savory, not dry, but moist and very tasteful. So by doing that, again, by getting rid of that flavor, what I do is I dunk it in, again, salt water with lime juice or fresh lemons. Lemon and lime. Okay, at the Dollar Tree, guys, look what I found. Isn't that so stinking adorable? Um, these are bath bombs. So I got the mermaid one. I got picked up a few of them because, and I have to be careful. Let me just get this off of here. How I, um, and as a matter of fact, I'm going to get them out of this room and put them in a, get them out of this room. Everything's falling down, guys. Crafty lunch. <laughs> I love that when Marilyn first said it. I couldn't stop laughing. Okay, so on the mermaid, if you guys can see, I picked two. Isn't that pretty? And this one is a coconut scent. Then they had um, this one over the rainbow. And this one's floral. This is just like that. My daughter has, I think my daughter might have the other ones. Does she? Okay. Oh. Let me share this, guys. This is not crafty stuff, but I usually, I have, I like to, when the Dollar Tree has something that I feel it shouldn't be there, I quickly grab my phone and I start, uh, I start looking for the item online and see what the prices are. So, I got this apple and cinnamon bat soak. And these make nice, I'm not going to put them in a stocking, so what I'm going to do is probably put them together in a um, little tiny box that's for my daughter then they had this hand wash apple and cinnamon I smelled it guys and it smells like fresh apple pie I, 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 I can just eat it right now but yeah we're not supposed to do that and this is hand wash soap on this one this is one for my one for me and one for my daughter so I picked up two of those then they had these facial wipes. They had apple cinnamon, so I picked up one. And this one is vanilla cream. So, again, I think one of the, each one of these packet online is like $4.99, I think, or $4.98. Okay, here goes some more of those bath bombs. And I can't even turn this one around. But this one is one of those, I don't know if you guys can see through there, is one of those emojis with the hearts. And this one is um, jasmine. Then this one is lavender. And again, these are great for stocking stuffing. This one's very, very pink. And that's the color in there. And look at this cute. I had a unicorn too. I don't know where it went. Uh, an ice cream cone. <laughs> look how cute that is. Yeah, I don't know where the unicorn is at. Hmm. And this is the other one. This one is coconut eco eucalyptus. I don't know. Something like that, guys. I told my husband, like, I am forgetting how to pronounce. Like, let me just put it this way. I'm forgetting how to speak English and Spanish. So, I don't know. That's okay, I'm not going to get out more often. That's why I like to go to Michael's and mingle. <laughs> Ay, ay, ay. My poor hubby. All right, guys. I'm going to stop this video here, and I'll come back and share the rest of the stuff that I got. Bye for now.